Razor chokes in the air as the most debonair man strides into the room. Spring of one of his lair as falls falls definitely there. Our black be the name of their doom. Ooh, that's our black, black any black any do. Yeah, uh, selling black the guy who says, uh, hmm. ooh. Gosh, our oh, chunks, quit it. You're breaking windows. What are you yelling about? Oh yeah, but I just had Otox come up with a nice motivational tune. And as punishment for getting beat by that hero again, I'm making him sing it a thousand times. A thousand? A thousand times? Gosh, you're more evil than I thought. Hey, but enough chatting. So where's the count, huh? I want to see him. He hasn't called me to go do anything, and I'm getting so bored. Uh, who's that? Is, is, is that? is that Mr. L? That is. My destructive little friend is already something itching to get back in action. Yes, Brobot is begging for me to take him out, and I say the word, and I'll roll out. Your great enthusiasm, but show the robot action plan for now, okay? Thing is, the Count Coin just left specific orders for us to stand by. Got that? No way! We're just supposed to wait here for the big mean hero to come and get us? That account doesn't need my service. Excellent. I'll just be off then. You go nowhere. We wait. It is the Count's direct order. His word is absolute. Be a good little minion and do not move until told. Okay? Thanks. Wow, she is one mean lady. But I'm bored. And Robot craves a daily smash. I can't just loiter here. There's no action. Aha! Uh -huh. Was is this Dementio? Is this Dementio? Yeah, it's Dementio. That crazy Dementio. The Count's orders are all absolute, completely without exception, yes. We shouldn't even dare to think about a secret sneak attack. Perish the thought. Defeating the hero would please the crowd greatly, but we must follow orders. Oopsie, I should remember something real important I gotta do. Back in a jiffy, bye. Yeah, yeah, if I got to go deflavorize the robot's, uh, the flavorizer. I don't know what's anything's up the code. Little Dementio. Uh, L Aether. L Aether. My, my, isn't that something? I do believe I should be moving on as well. <laughs> wow, what a strange cutscene. Look, Timpani, the stars are beautiful, aren't they? There's a tradition in my village. We believe that wishes on stars can come true. Oh, is that so? In that case, we better get wishing, don't you think? I don't need to wish anymore. Hmm? I already got my wish. Now I have everything I need right here. Timpani. Aren't you cold? Not at all. I'm very warm. Can we stay like this? Just a little longer? More plot. Don't you love plot? Welcome to Super Paper Mario, everybody. It, it's a good day to be to be MC Gamer. As we play through this magical game of Tippy. What's the matter, Tippy? Didn't you just hear something? No, we we're not we are not crazy, you see, you crazy butterfly. Ah darn that void again. Wow. That is really big. We need to go open up that door quickly. And luckily, I know exactly where we need to go for this one. Because Hot Dog... Uh, you see, the thing about the, the these um, other ones that we have to deal with are, are they are actually inside the same exact spot as we got them on flip side, but in flop side. Uh, I mean, the puzzles are a bit different, but I do know where one is, so that actually is a benefit to us all, I do say. Oh ho, you're back! Oh good, it's Professor Oak. Hello! Have you seen the sky lately? The void continues to grow larger. I imagine that some worlds have already started to decay. I wonder how long till our dear Flipside will be spared. The Light Pognescus doesn't say anything about how long we have? The Light Pognescus was only written to counteract the Dark One. As such, it's not truly prophetic, so it's hard to say literally how long we have. And yet, I feel confident saying that we do not have much time at all. Wow, that... that Thanks for the cheery news. Oh, he's, he has a message from Norlam. There's a heart pillar. All right, we'll go and uh, look for it. Oh, and Flopside, that was the plan anyway. I wish there was an easier way to get to Flopside, but eh, I believe there's a, where is it, a down? There's a down elevator somewhere over here. 
This is like screen tearing. Do you see that screen tearing that's going on? I don't even know what's going on with my capture card. It's silly capture card, man. It's just like, well, I'm gonna screen tear. Never had screen tearing before. Keeping things fresh, as always, being a video game recorder. <laughs> you never know what to expect, I suppose. One does not- oh yeah, I think it's behind here. It's the entrance to flop side. Indeed. So let's just flip. And... If we hurry up, we can actually start heading on right on over. Flop. <laughs> right into the door. I like how sometimes you can use the 3D to kind of like, you know... I don't want to say cheat, but you know, it, it, there's like convenient little tricks that you can do with the 3D just to, to not have to always be using it. Save some of your 3D bar. Even though technically, you have like so much uh, extra like flippy flip magic because you don't need to use it all. Alright, so is this, we have to go down here at this end? Yeah. And flip. Booyah. We're doing excellent, I do say. Um, do we want to go down? I think we want to go up. Because we need to take the... Um, you know... The, the, the 3D Bridge of Awesome. Uh, we need to take that out. So, let's just uh, get on carry. Wait for our, our 3D bar to fill up a little bit. We'll go over by Norlem's house. Because I believe it's right here. Yes, sir. Wait, hold on. I believe I remember this guy being able to do something magical for us. I saw him in 3D. Hello, sir. Ah, another great day for Wilderberg. Working in sunshine, what does he does? He can make a... 300 coins. Sure, I'll pay it. Because I don't apparently have any sense of words. So, he makes a... Did he just use his bridge as a... Or hurts his beard as a drill. What a wacky guy. Okay, so yeah. Now we have a pipe that goes directly to flip side. So that's actually a very good thing to <laughs> buy for ourselves. That's what I'd like to call a worthy investment. <laughs> or something. So let's head on out here. I see a block that we can smash. Uh, does it... Doesn't seem to be anything else over here. I mean, this is the one that we've already put a... Yeah, we... Wow, there's actually like a heart pillar there. Oh, wait a minute. That's the one that we already got over in flip side. So, there's not one here in flop side. This is wacky. Uh, why don't we just use... Kudge. Here is block. Boom! Pipe action. Fantastic magical. And what do we have here? Whoa! Hold on, these guys are tricky. Hold on. Booyah! 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 We don't. We haven't done nearly enough like awesome moves in this. We're like severely under leveled in this game, but I'm okay with that because I'm a boss, and I and I've been able to spam healing items. Yeah, here it is. All right, and I see a. Oh, what's this? Uh, I can't get under that. Wait, yes I can. Dottie. I always forget about Dottie. Booyah. Booyah. Switching. And now I, we actually saw that there's a block ahead, so I guess I'll just switch to Kudge now. Whoa! Beautiful use of magic. Whoa! That was a close one. Smash this. Press the button. And, by the power of grave flop side, heart pillar. <laughs> I knew where this one is. It, we're, we don't have any heart pillars left, but don't get used to that. Do do do, blue ooh, heart, do do, magic stuff words. We'll go and make blue, 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 make a brand new door. Oh, it's gonna be purple. Oh no, it's just dark blue. What a ripoff, man. I like blue, so so I'm, I'm not complaining. But I mean, oh. Uh, what were you quoting there? 
It seems it's suggested that if you fail to pass these duels, all worlds will be ruined, and apparently your lives will be lost along with the purity heart. I know that you've only just shared your might. You only deserve to just... What are you on about? Darn it, Norlem. Why are you such an emo guy? <laughs> Norlem, you're so emo. You crazy, crazy guy. How do I access my magical, important things of a turnpipe? Yes, I want to use it. I want to use this pipe. So, I, I don't know. Uh, I don't think we'll head into the blue door this time. I think we'll save that for the next time that we play. Because I believe we can just head right on in. There's no... Nothing holding us back. But look at that, guys. This is going to be chapter 6 right here. And then there's going to be chapter 7. And then... We're heading on to the final part of the game. Which... I, I, I'm pretty sure there's actually a chapter 8. Which is basically the final chapter. Uh, but we're almost there, guys. We're almost there. <sighs> I just woke up, man. <laughs> I've been avoiding yawning this entire episode, but I just couldn't hold it back any longer. Just as I was heading to the save block, too. Dar gosh darn. So next time on Super Paper Mario, we head into the next chapter. We'll see you then. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.